please, let me do the dishes. That's the least I can do. I'm crashing here. Crashers clean dishes. Your family. Besides, if they're not clean the right way, David becomes a big baby about it all. I'm a pro at this point. No, no, no. I insist. Grab this sponge and you're going to be eating it too. It's not a big deal. I've got it. No, I know you don't mind, but I, I won't be here for too long. Just, you know, gotta get back on my feet a little. You're right. I don't mind. But David does. Is that it? Maybe a little bit. No, actually, forget I said that. Uh, that wasn't for me to... Just forget it. Sorry. Forget you said what? Thanks. So where do you think you'll go? Don't know. With what happened, I'd be amazed if I could get a job assistant coaching T-ball. You'll land on your feet. Well, here's hoping. I could use a fresh start. Uh, I'll, I'll probably just travel around, you know, see what's out there. Want to take me with you? Well? Kate, come on. I mean, you know that's a bad idea. Of course I do. I'm just messing around. It's just hard to say no to a fresh start. Always wanted to go to Norway. See the northern lights. Uh, you'll be jet-setting and I'll still just be here. Oh, oh god damn it! Oh Ooh, shit, quick, shit, running shit, underwater. shit! That was David's army glass. Oh, he's gonna be so pissy about it. I can hear him already. Oh, it's so annoying. He should be more worried about you slicing your hand open. He should be. There you go. See? Much better. What was that noise? Guys! You're... You're gonna be okay. Hello? My CEO gave me that. And unless you want to dig up his fucking corpse, he's not gonna give me another well, one. Why don't we get an actual dishwasher? Oh. Here we go again. Then you won't be on my ass anytime there's a spot on a fork. Excuse me? If we could even afford a dishwasher. It is just a glass. It was important to me, Javi. A glass? We don't see your ass for a year. A year. Then when your life goes to shit, we're expected to drop everything and roll out the red carpet. All for Prince Javi. And now you're going to start telling me how to talk to my wife? This isn't about him. Really? He's the one standing right there, judging me for something he doesn't understand. You don't know him like I do. Always judging everyone, except himself. You know what? You're right. It's none of my business. No. It's not. I'm sorry about the glass. Really. It's fine. It was an accident. Don't worry, I can handle him. He's just in a mood. Trust me, it won't last. it easy. What happened? They got away. Oh god. Mariana. I already dug a grave for her.
This was my fault, Mariana. God, God damn it. I'm so sorry, honey. Javi, thank you for staying. I think you probably saved my life. I should have gone with them. No, we fought. We slowed them down. And now they'll come back for us, right? I... I, I don't know. Maybe. A second. She carried this around for years. Sorry, I never found you those candy bars. You deserved just so much more life. You should have been the one burying me. Except someday. Someday far away. You did everything you possibly... The other guys had this too. Oh, shit. What? Well, what's wrong? Clem? I've run into these guys before. Who are they? Please? They call themselves the New Frontier. They used to be decent people. Now they're something else. This brand they have. It's like an initiation thing. I was kind of stuck in their camp for a while. Not by choice. It was bad. I'm lucky to be alive. What'd you do to piss them off? You do kind of have a temper sometimes. I got out. That's all that matters. They left one of their cars behind. That's something at least. Good. Just like you always wanted. I can take you back to Prescott, make sure your family's okay. But then I'm hitting the road. You should stay with us. Let's just get back to Prescott. <laughs> 